If you're looking to spruce up your roast potatoes, then we have the perfect little recipe. These are so good. What did we just make? Roasted potatoes topped with toasted nuts and seeds and also some toasted uh, chorizo lettuce on there. Put it on a bed of basically it's a tzatziki, yogurt with cucumber and uh, mint. It is. It looks incredible. I mean, if it's you were really hosting good. a dinner party, then this should definitely be on your table. Let's get into the recipe. First thing you do is peel my potatoes and I'm going to parboil them. The way I like to cut my potatoes is I like to cut them on a diagonal. That way when they parboil and you shake them up, all these little edges will be really, really fluffy and crispy. I'm going to put it into some cold water to prevent them from oxidizing and getting brown. I've got cold water here. I'm just going to salt it and I will be adding my potatoes into the cold water. Right here I have my topping for my potatoes. So I've got some pecans, I have some sunflower seeds and I have some coriander seeds that I'm going to toast. Okay, so here we have our toasted uh, spices. So I've chopped these up really finely. I'm going to add a little bit of heat to that as well. This is about the fineness that you want them. They don't have to be like, like powder, but just nice and fine. Maybe just lightly salt season with some salt and some pepper. I'm going to add our oil now. Nice mix. Okay, so we can put this aside now. We have our seeds and our nuts in the olive oil. They're going to act as a topping for our potatoes when they're finished. But the other thing we're going to add is some chorizo lettuce as well. So I'm going to cut this up like this. We let these dry out for a few minutes and now I'm going to fluff them up. So a good shake. Season them with salt and pepper and some sumac as well. base for them though. We've got some really thick Greek yogurt here. I'm going to grate some cucumber. Basically I'm making a tzatziki but without the garlic. I leave the skin on because it's tasty. Okay I'm just squeezing some of the liquid out of the cucumber. Okay and in it goes. Okay so I have some nice mint here, some fresh mint. And put a little bit of that in there as well. A little bit of salt in there. Okay, I'm also going to top it off with a little bit more chili. Take your time. Okay. Ready? Cheers. Cheers.
Mmm. 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 That's really good. Oh, there's a kick to it. A little bit of heat. A little bit of chili in there as well. Mmm, but that? Mmm. That's 10 out of 10. Mm Mmm. Delish. Okay. We hope you all (laughs) enjoyed this recipe. Um, The recipe will be on our website, so we'll link that down below. And as always, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, that would be amazing as well. And any comments would be great. Yeah, only positive ones, though. (laughs) Anyways, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.